friends, what's up? So today is Sunday. We just had our baby shower yesterday and it was so much fun. Um, so I thought today it would be cool to show you guys everything that we were given at our baby shower. We got a ton of stuff and I really love watching these videos from other people. So I thought it would be fun to share with you guys everything that we were given at our baby shower. Um, so just a little like backstory about the baby shower. Austin's family is like about two, two and a half hours away from where we live and where my family is. So we really like to be able to do things that, you know, joined together, um, but also it's kind of hard for people to travel. So initially we had tried to make this our one and only baby shower down by Austin's family's house. However, the only people from my family that were able to go were my parents, my grandma, and then um, my sister and her husband and kids, and then my best friend, Caitlin. So a lot of people from my family weren't able to go, which was unfortunate. So my aunt is actually going to throw us another baby shower up here, um, which will be really cool too, so I'm excited about that. So this is everything that we got from our first baby shower down by Austin's family's house and there's quite a bit of stuff so I'm just gonna jump right into it. First we have like bath related items. Um, we got this pack of towels. It's a two pack of towels so this is just um, a plain normal towel and it has little dinosaurs on it and this is like a terry cloth fabric towel and it has a little hood that looks like a dinosaur and I'm obsessed with it. It is seriously so cute. It's funny because I did not actually register for this. Um, I did register for these, I believe, um, the dinosaur washcloths, but whoever picked us up this also got us the towels, which was really cool. So, yeah, we also got these little dinosaur washcloths. He doesn't have anything, like, dinosaur related, but I just thought they were super cute. I don't know. I liked them a lot, so <laughs> we got those. We also got another hooded towel, and this one is green also, and it just has little elephants on it. We didn't have any hooded towels or any towels or washcloths for him at all before this, so I'm really excited about these. They're super cute. And then we also got this little bathrobe, which I think is so adorable. It has a little hood, and the hood has these little ears. Oh my gosh, it's so precious. And it has um, a bunch of little sheep on it too, so super cute. I love it. And then we also got one of these Johnson um, body wash and shampoos, which is really great. Obviously, we're going to need a ton of this, so love that. And then we were also given this little gift set, so it comes with that same um, body wash and shampoo. And it looks like just one that is like a normal shampoo. And then um, a diaper rash cream, the Destin, Destin, Destin. Oh, it was on the top. Destitin. Desitin diaper rash cream and then a little lotion so all things that we didn't have that we needed so I'm super grateful for that and it's so cute it came in like a little um, basket so I love it and then sticking with the theme of like personal grooming items we also were given this grooming kit which comes with a ton of stuff I'm super excited about it so this kit includes like a little hairbrush and comb a little toothbrush thermometer um like the nail clippers and then like the little booger sucker bulbs thing and then this right here is like a little medicine dispenser that you can give them like liquid medicine with also these like little nail files and it comes with a super cute little bag to keep it all in and someone else also got us this which is like a little smaller version of that it has the brush comb clippers and the little booger sucker which I think is great we can just keep this big one at home and then throw this stuff in his diaper bag um, so I think it's really great that we got actually like duplicates of some of that stuff and then we also got this little um, diaper bag dispenser so it has it kind of looks like like the dog poop bags I think it's like basically the same thing but um, it has this little hook container thing that you can put the baggies in so if you're out you can just throw this in his diaper bag and if he has a poopy diaper you can just tie it up in one of these before you throw it away so you're not like stinking up people's bathrooms or what have you all right and then moving on into breastfeeding or just like generally feeding related items we got this box of steam bags so I think it comes with five 
each bag can be used up to 20 times, which is really great. So you can put like your different pump and bottle parts in this and microwave it. I think I would use it probably at work more so, um, but you can put stuff like that in here and microwave it and it's supposed to just steam and sterilize all of your pump and bottle parts. And then you can also store your pump and bottle parts in here like in the fridge at work too. So really excited about these. And then we also got a box of breast milk storage bags. This comes with 50 bags in it. So this is a great start. I will definitely be needing these for um, to stock up for when I have to go back to work. So. I'm really excited about these. And then I also got this huge box of bottles, which I'm super excited about. I just registered, that glare kind of sucks. Hold on, let me try to, let me try to fix this. So I had initially registered for just like a two pack of bottles, I think, or two or three pack. But um, I think my grandma got me this. She actually got me this big box, which was amazing. It comes with two of the nine ounce bottles and then three of the four ounce bottles. And then um, it looks like it also comes with some extra nipples and some pacifiers and like a little brush to clean the bottles. Yeah, so this is, this is over a $60 value. So I'm super excited about this. Bottles are super expensive. And I just had heard really good things about the Philips Advent. Advent? Philips event? I don't know. But I'm really excited um, to use these. Hopefully these work as good as the reviews that I've read. And then the last breastfeeding related item that I got is probably one of the things I'm most excited about that I got from the whole day. And it is this Haka silicone breast pump. So um, I didn't even know these existed until my mother-in-law sent me a picture of one and said that she heard that I really needed one. So I ended up registering for one and reading about it and finding out what it is. And it's so cool. So basically when you're pumping or breastfeeding, on just one side the other side naturally will have some like leakage and stuff and usually like it just comes out and you lose it but this allows you to put it on that other side to collect the leakage so that that milk's not going to waste so I think this is super cool and will definitely help me with you know getting my stockpile up and I'm super excited to use it. So next up we have a few toys that he got which I'm super excited about. So someone got him this little rattle and it's a little elephant and then on the bottom it has like a little teether part. And then he also got these little teethers. But these little bottom parts um, he can just chew on when he's teething and it's got really bright colors and different textures and stuff so I'm sure he'll love this. And then we got this toy, which is super cute. It looks like a PlayStation or like Xbox controller, which is so funny. Um, Austin plays um, PlayStation and Xbox, and then his dad and uncle are also like really into it. So I think it's super cute, and Bentley can play with his little Xbox controller while daddy plays too. So that'll be so cute to watch. And then the last toy that he got is this little bunny. It is so cute. I love it. And it's funny because I actually, when I was born, was given a little white stuffed bunny that I still have to this day. And I named her Marshmallow and she was like, I could not sleep without her. I love her so much. So the fact that Bentley got a little white bunny like made my heart so happy and I can't wait to see him snuggle with this. So next up is just a couple of like miscellaneous items. Somebody got us this humidifier, which is supposed to be really good for the baby's nursery or wherever the baby's sleeping to um, help with like his breathing and stuff. It just puts some extra moisture into the air, which will be really great because he's gonna be born in the fall and like winter time. So it's gonna be really dry in the air. So I'm really excited to use this to help with baby Bentley's little breathing and help him to sleep better. And then next up, we also got a wipe warmer, which I'm excited about. I didn't actually register for a wipe warmer just because I had heard like mixed feelings about whether or not it was really necessary. And I'm the type of person that doesn't like to register for like excessive things or expensive things or just anything that I'm not 100% sure that we really need or are going to use because it was something I was kind of going back and forth about debating like whether or not I wanted to try one. So I'm super excited that we got this and I'm hoping that we'll get a lot of good use out of it. And then next we just got three packs of little baby cloth clothing hangers. So I'm really excited about these. We did pick up I think two packs from Walmart ourselves but I mean you can never have too many like 
hangers right so I'm super excited okay so next I'm gonna move on to clothing items I actually didn't register for many clothes um, the only things that I did reg register for were a couple of like the swaddle me swaddles and then um, a couple of like sleep gowns or like sleep sacks and that was just because I did get a ton of clothes from garage sales and also like hand-me-downs and stuff so um, he does have a ton of clothes however I love everything that everybody got him he so that's the reason why he didn't get too many clothes which I'm not upset about because like I said we have a ton but everything that he did get is really cute and I know he's gonna love to wear it so first of all he got this um, four pack yes four pack of long sleeve onesies they're so cute this one says new to the crew which I love and then there's this super cute white one with some like black crosses on it and then a really nice just like plain dark gray one and this one too which is so cute it just has little arrows I love this um, it's definitely my aesthetic I love black and white and gray so he's gonna look super cute in these and I will like match anything so I'm really excited about these you can never have too many onesies next we got this adorable two-pack of Batman onesies which I love it is so cute and I love how the little belt has like a rattle and bottle like that's so clever and there's just this print on the back so I love that I can't wait for him to wear this and then we also got this oh my gosh I'm obsessed it says mommy's catch with a little football and on the knees it says touchdown it has a little football oh my gosh it's so cute and then this little long sleeve onesie too. It's just like got a bunch of different sports themes on it. I love it. Anything with like footballs on it, I've been trying to pick up just because obviously Austin played football. So it's kind of like the theme of his room. It was the theme of his baby shower. So it's super cute. We also ended up getting two of these outfits, which I think is so funny because I didn't even register for this. So whoever got us these like great minds think alike, but they are different sizes so one of them is six months and the other one is nine months so we might keep both <laughs> they're so cute i love these little um sleepers and it comes with socks and a hat too so i don't know i love them i love the elephants i love the gray and white and then he also got this little outfit which is 12 months which is really good he doesn't have a ton of clothes for 12 and up months so it's just this little zip up hoodie and then these little gray sweatpants so he's gonna look so cute in this i can't wait hopefully it'll be like around fall time when he's able to fit in these and then we also got this onesie which is so cute it says if you can read this you're close enough to change my diaper i love it and um it's from lake of the ozarks which austin's aunt has a house there and he was hoping he actually said to me the day before i hope that they um get us a onesie or like clothes with something that says like the ozarks on it so the fact that they did was so funny but yeah i love this it's so cute and then he also did get a couple of bibs so he got this baby's first halloween bib which i am obsessed with so he'll be here his due date is a week before halloween so i think it'll be so cute to just put him in a little onesie and this and then i have a little like frankenstein hat that i was given by my aunt so to just like dress him up in this and like take cute pictures obviously we're not gonna like go out anywhere but i think it'll be so cute for a couple of photos so i love that so much and then he also got this bib which says grandma said i could <laughs> i love it so precious and then he got this little Nike hat. It's a toddler size, so it'll be when he's a little bit bigger, but oh my gosh, it's so cute. And I actually have a black hat that has a white Nike symbol on it. So I feel like if we wear this together, it'll be mom and son goals. So cute. The last thing as far as clothing goes actually wasn't um, a gift really, but it was part of the shower. So my sister was in charge of like the games and activities for the shower and she actually set up this onesie making station but instead of like drawing on it with markers or whatever she got a kit of like little iron on um, decals and she had like a little station with two irons and like you could make your own onesies. It was freaking adorable. I was obsessed with it and all the decals she got were like most of them are like football related or like sports related so they're super cute we have 
quite the stack of decorated onesies and then also there was quite a few onesies left over that didn't get decorated so so many onesies we got um, I'll just show you a few of them this one says mommy's little rookie this snuggle is real this one is so cute she must have like been able to personalize them I think she did it off an Etsy shop but it says just joined team Miller oh my goodness and then there's this football quarterback one this little one that says champ and she did get the onesies in different sizes which is awesome so there's like newborn and then all the way up to like six to nine months I'm seeing so yeah that's super cool he'll be able to wear them um, a lot cutest baby league Oh, there's so many. I want to show you all of them. This is the one that I actually decorated. Obviously. <laughs> I heart mommy and the heart is a little football. Oh my goodness. So yeah, this was so fun. I loved this. And yeah, she did a great job with all the activities and games. It was so much fun. And then moving on to more like bedding related items, I guess. We got this four pack of little flannel blankets, which is great. So we had a couple of blankets that I had gotten from like garage sales, um, like a couple of receiving blankets, but we didn't have nearly enough. So I'm super excited about these. They're so cute and white and gray, which I love. And two of them have the little animals on it. Oh, so cute. We actually ended up getting two of these AeroPrint fuzzy blankets which I did register for, but I'm honestly excited that we got two because I feel like we can like keep one in the nursery, keep one downstairs. You can never have too many blankets. So I'm glad that we got two of them and they're ones that I picked out and really love. So even better. And then we also got the matching crib sheets for these blankets. So I think it'll look super cute. Um, his crib is white. So to have like this in his crib with this little blanket like hanging off the edge just for like aesthetic purposes, oh, it'll be so precious. And then we also got this plain gray crib sheet and Austin and I had bought a crib sheet also because it was on like clearance. Um, I think it's like Chevron print. So now we have three crib sheets for him, which I think is enough, right? Right. <laughs> so I think we're good on crib sheets, but I'm so excited. I love them so much. And then we also got this super cute blanket, which again is white and just has a gray little animal print on it and it's like a jersey style so i don't know i really love this material and i think it'll look super cute and obviously we will use it a ton and then we got this changing pad cover which we didn't have any of we do have a changing table and a changing pad for him but we didn't have any cover so i'm really glad that we got this one it is super cute and gray and will match his room perfectly and then we also got this mattress cover pad which i really 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 wanted it's 100 percent waterproof and stain repellent which y'all know we are going to be needing with baby bentley leaking through his diaper in his crib so i'm super excited to have this that way um if he leaks through it won't get into his mattress or anything we can just wash this and, and i'm really excited to go and put it on his crib right away and then we got this giant laundry hamper which i'm so excited for it's just white and gray stripes it's super cute and i can't wait to put that in his room um i think i'm gonna pick up one more of those so i can have one for like dirty clothes and then one for outgrown clothes so as he outgrows his clothes i can just like instead of putting it back in the drawer and like keeping trying it on him i can just throw it in that bin and then as it gets full um separated and like donated or whatever I'm gonna do with it so yeah I love that so much and something else that my sister picked up for us which I knew she was gonna get because we had talked about it um beforehand is the Owlet smart sock I'm so excited about this so my sister messaged me on Facebook a couple weeks ago and said that she had found one on Facebook marketplace that was like half the price if you guys don't know these are like three hundred dollars um if you don't know what these are actually in general it's these little socks that you put on baby's foot and it has a monitor in it so as he's sleeping um it monitors his heart and his oxygen levels so if something were to happen where he like rolled and like he couldn't get any oxygen um the alarm would go off and it would wake us up so it's kind of just like a peace of mind thing i've heard some people that don't like it because um 
of it giving like false alarms but I guess I'm under the mindset I'd rather get up because of a false alarm than it be a real situation and not wake up so I think it'll give me peace of mind and the majority of the reviews I've read said that they loved it that it was like the only reason they were able to sleep at night and not just continue to like check on baby so um yeah it came she got this from a woman that lived near her off of Facebook marketplace but like some of the stuff was still in the original packaging she still had the little pamphlet for it um so this is the little monitor part and then it came with several socks one two three four five six seven socks so that's great all in different sizes and then the actual little sensor part is right here so my sister picked us up for picked that up for us and I'm super thankful like I said she got it like half of what it originally is which is amazing because I did not really want to spend $300 <laughs> on something like this um so yeah I'm very excited and she also said that the woman she bought it from told her if I have any questions about it that I could contact her and she would be super happy to like help me out with it and tell me how it works and everything so that was really great and such a big blessing and then Austin's mom got him <laughs> this little daddy's diaper kit. I don't know if you guys have seen anything like this on like Pinterest. It's so funny. So let me show you everything that's inside. This is like stuffed with things and um, a lot, most of it's actually like really useful. So there's this little rattle toy that it looks like you can like strap on his car seat. Super cute. And then a little stuffed football toy. So cute some butt paste which I registered for and we didn't get any so thanks grandma Jen now we got some and we got some washcloths so we got these two and then there's one with like a little lion on it and then a few more bibs <laughs> so cute this one oh my gosh so cute and this which I've never seen before it's really nice it's like wipes but I think you can it's like a little bag and you can refill it with wipes so it's super cute and then a couple of binkies and this little baby book which I'm sure he will love and a few little tiny baby diapers oh my goodness they're so small and then this cute little banana teether which I'm sure he will love and then we get to the funny stuff so she got these little diaper sack bags which Again, like we probably still will use these, but I just think it's so funny. And then for daddy to change his diaper, which this is going to seem dramatic, but I would not put it past him for me to come home one day and him be using these items to change his diaper. We have, we have some safety goggles, <laughs> some face masks, tongs, <laughs> and this little fan, which you can like sh hook on you or put on your neck and it like blows air up towards your face so yeah those were all of the gifts that we got and then <laughs> i'm laughing because i'm staring at this wall of diapers and wipes we ended up doing a diaper raffle which is where if you bring like any pack of diapers um your name your name gets put in a raffle to win a prize and so i think everybody participated in that and some people got us like actual big boxes of diapers so that's exciting and we also got look i'll show you this is the diapers we got um all of these are diapers and then my sister also did a an activity where people could write on the diapers like late night diapers and they have little messages on them so that box is actually full of those diapers and then this bag is leftovers from those packages and then over here we have a box of wipes and then the rest of those are just wipes too so yes and people are awesome they gave us i see size one two i know there's sizes four and five in there so i'm really happy that um people like got a wide variety of sizes so yes those are all the diapers so that is everything that we got for our baby shower we feel so blessed we were not expecting 
all of this stuff <laughs> and I was talking to Austin earlier it's crazy that one day you can feel like completely unprepared and like terrified and then the next day you're like he could come and it would be okay like we have pretty much everything we need so thank you to everybody that showed up to our baby shower and had fun with us and brought us gifts we feel so overwhelmed and blessed so thank you guys and especially a big thank you to um, our parents my mom and dad and Austin's mom and dad and my sister who threw the baby shower for us and took care of all of the food and decorations and games and activities and put so much time and money and like energy into this for us we can't thank you enough we feel so blessed so <laughs> With that being said, I have a lot to do. I have a lot to put away and wash and sort and fold. I'm very excited. Enough of that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys like this video. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you guys in the next one. I hope you guys have a great day or night.